programming today has changed our life and changed the world we live in so drastically. With this global rapid growth, countries such as Japan, Australia, UK and even Singapore have recognised the need to prepare their citizens for the 21st century and have already incorporated coding as part of their national school curriculum as early as age 7 or lower. It's no wonder that our kids nowadays have increasing exposure to digital devices. And this has led to the rate of myopia in Singapore more than doubling since the 1930s from 40% to 85% in adults currently. Add this to the increasing demand for coding knowledge, where the children of today are digital natives and many start coding at P2 to P3 and parents are naturally mindful about the need to protect their kids' eyes. Well, since we started in 2015, we have seen a five-fold increase in demand for coding classes here at Coding Lab. With hundreds of students coming through our two-hour enrichment classes on a weekly basis, we definitely want to ensure that we invest in the right environment for them to remain comfortable both in our classrooms and also at home when practicing their code. We have bright and well-ventilated classrooms with warm lighting and comfortable and height-adjustable swivel seats to ensure comfort for our students. We also wanted screens that took care of our students' eyes that could especially take them through assignments, prolonged schoolwork and entertainment or even during our home-based e-learning classes. Based on our research and according to what we read on WebMD, a high refresh rate and low colour temperature for reduced blue light emission were important factors in deciding what screens we would want to use on our campuses. On top of that, the ease of adjusting the brightness and the height of the monitors, just like our chairs, would be an added bonus to custom fit our students' differing ages and heights. Typically, students get back from school between about you know, 2.30 to 4.30 p.m. and most of the time, they'll start on their school homework or their assigned projects before dinner which can range from maybe 4 to 5 p.m. And at 4 to 5 p.m. there is good natural lighting from the sun and from outside. But this very quickly changes as dusk approaches. Most of the time if they are too engrossed in their work, you know, to adjust the brightness or they forget to turn on the lights at when dusk approaches, the brightness intelligence sensor with its auto brightness adjustment feature will ensure that their eyes are protected, especially at home, where eye breaks and proper lighting may not be as strictly enforced. Well, our students are growing every day. You know, some of them have been buzzed for four years and they've really grown. So allowing height adjustments with their monitors and chairs would definitely help to ensure good seating posture. Our tutors actually mentioned to me that she really liked the brightness intelligence function of the screen. So it would auto adjust for her eyes when she turned it on. And most parents have also said that it's really cool and they will actually stand outside the classroom to read the eye health tips. It's just like how in school, children learn English, math, mother tongue and science. So no matter what their career choices are, but it is by learning these subjects that they pick up transferable skills that are applicable across different fields. Learning how to code teaches them the 21st century skill of computational thinking.